Hello, Internet friends. My name is Bay. And this is Final Fantasy VII Rebirth, but I'm bad. A light commentary playthrough here on the PlayStation 5. We find ourselves in the Corel Prison area outside the Gold Saucer. That's not what I wanted to do. There we go. We're just essentially under the Gold Saucer outside of it. And I'm sort of I'm still trying to figure out and talk to NPCs and see what's going on here. There's a lot of like little things to do. No need to say a word. I know your story. I also happen to know that you've racked up a few QB wins at the casino. As its owner, allow me to express my gratitude. Some players have no restraint. You did me a great favor. Take this as a token of my thanks. Okay. Before you go, though. I have some cards I'd highly recommend for a player as skilled as yourself. You won't want to miss out. I have everything he has to offer. Okay. But I guess this is the one-stop shop for boosters, depending on where the game's at. People lose interest when they start thinking they can't win. That's why it's important to shake things up once in a while. By the way, don't breathe a word about this to the folks upstairs, unless you want to find yourself behind bars again. And that makes three. Once Pico's had his fill, he'll be ready to hit the track and win us that race. Only cards of the highest quality, guaranteed. Feel free to win, but don't let it get out of hand. Right. Keep your noses to the grindstone, people! You better I've undergone a version upgrade. Your Queen's Essence level is no match for mine. Improve your performance to challenge me. I must be level 7? Oh my god. I really don't know how to read this. So which which way is what way on this note, man? So this is the large it's the same layout as the map, I guess. Okay, much of the same layout as the map. So what is this? hitting circle to back out of that all you do is hit the same button again so what am i looking for here there's a chimera in that building Gus's place has stamp graffiti. That's what we're checking for here. Oh, this is the bar. Sorry, this is the bar. The bar apparently has Cosmo Canyons. Watering hole for the dregs of the Dust Bowl. Heard you're in the market for some greens. Maybe. If so, I've got a garden up on the cliff. 
Everything's yours for the taking. Why? Assuming there's anything to take, I haven't tended to it in ages. Here, go see for yourself. Be sure to keep an eye out for fiends, though. The place is crawling with them. Found the one place around here that had a spot of green. But the road there's so rough, I stopped going. I haven't tended to those plants in ages, but I'm sure something's still alive. Found the one place around I haven't tended to those plants in ages. Really, Claire? Is that a good idea? You seem like a guy who can hold his liquor. That's our house specialty. Call it sunshine. We take moonshine and water it down so the flavor's just still perceptible. Okay. So sunshine, not Cosmo Canyon. I can't see if they sell anything else, so that's why I'm... All right, well. Now from here, the other circle is the item shop. Need some. This is the item shop, not the weapon shop. Well, of course they sell potions here. shop is completely silent. It's even called dead silent. The weapon shop is not Rickley Sled and sells potions. That's the item shop. That's also a lie. Take care of your weapons. We're trying to figure out who is lying, and so far all of those people have been lying. So then where's the other building was here. Oh, I have to go to the bookstore. If you're looking to get stronger, my store has everything you'll need. I do have 20 points. I'm going to have to do a respec here soon. I imagine. My store will always be open to you. So we're looking for Garth's autobiography. How am I supposed to know that's even here? Oh. You have an eye for fine literature. That's the first volume of Solemn Gus's best-selling autobiography, Meditations on the Outlaw Life. It's the tale of a lonely little boy who dreamed of running his very own prison. Like the tagline says, there's a bit of Gus in all of us. You'd be a fool to miss this chance to partake of Gus's wisdom. By the time you've read to the end, you'll see the world in a whole new light. So it's... Gus's book, not Garth's book. So, saying it's Garth's is also a lie. Is it the joke they're all lying? The only one I'm looking for now is graffiti on...
So is there any stamp? Oh, it's right over there. So is the lie that there is or wasn't? It's there. I'm gonna go back over and talk to all those people then and figure it out. I think they're all lying. What the heck is this? Alright. That goes down, not up. Now, if I remember how to get back to all of where those people were. They were in here. place to get loaded then look no further than bail jumper it's the only bar that serves cosmo canyons yeah they don't serve cosmo canyons you've been to the weapon shop it's ridiculously loud in there i like it though helps me relax plus they sell potions there too nope the weapon shop is completely quiet and doesn't sell you gotta check out garf's autobiography Meditations on the underling life. Gus's. It's kind of weird, but Gus has a picture of stamp on us. I swear, it looks like it could jump out and start licking your face. So that was true. The only truth. Gus does have stamp on the wall. You should test your might in the beast battleground. Incorrect. You got a rare monster named. Well, do you think you can figure out who's telling the truth? Yes. You gotta check out Garf's autobiography. It's you should. Hey, did you see the stamp graffiti over at Gus's crib? He made. Okay. Congratulations. Their deception was no match for your powers of perception. Beware, my aspiring swindlers. Clever ones like this are harder to fool. But so long as you continue to train and apply yourselves, I can teach you to swindle even the toughest marks. Yes, yes sir. sir. <laughs> as for you, rest assured that I am a man of my word. Those greens are hard to find in a place like this. Quite the handsome reward, wouldn't you say? Or was he hiding that? You think the gear Esther's got is any good? Ideally, it'd give Pico an edge and be pleasing to the eye. Our boys want handsome bird, you, you know. Something, you we want equipment that'll accentuate its features. Your your life? Get out. All right, how do I get to the garden? Actually, oh, am I locked for now? Oh. So it was going to the garden for later? Okay. Was it through here? Oh, 
gravity. Let's go. Mm hmm. Look at that noise. Oh, oh! Oh, what? The dark over there, but it's not. Oh gosh, we do be running. Oh, rust rake. We won't hold that. It's like one. <laughs> <laughs> little guy how'd you get up there you just defy the laws of physics because you're a weird little magical cactus Gotten up through here. Oh, we do this fast. Here I come. Gotcha. 
I was just scared to get close to them. That'll do. Gotcha. Let's do this. Going in. Going all out. Brace yourself. Yikes. Is there a Cactuar Fortress up here? I am getting the feeling there is. To a cactar trap. Find out. See? are you? Another HP up. I'm just dead. Gotta be careful. Yep. This is game over, huh? Yep. Wow. Yep. TV, the little cast.
So those are all the side objectives? So the untended garden has turned into a, uh, a cactar patch. There's a cactar patch out there too. Why does that sound like Green Day? I totally heard Green Day. Disappointing my man, Gus. Pico's been feeling peckish. We have lots. Yeah, he's looking a lot better now. But we could get him in great shape with a touch more. Uh huh. Pico's right as rain and fit to hit the track whenever you are. When you're ready to head up to the stadium, just speak to your babysitter over there. <laughs> oh, before you go, if you happen to have any more greens, consider trading them in for racing gear. Vegetables are hard to come by down here, so I'd be happy to buy yours. Hey, nice find, Merc. Well, wait, if there's three, then there's one more to get. Unless you have to get it later. Unless there is just one more somewhere, I don't know. This will definitely come in handy for our next champion bird. Having trouble finding that feed for Pico? Let me think. What about... Oh, that stalker game. Bet they got something. Might have to beat it out of them, though. Good luck out there, cutie pie. The stalker game? Oh. There was one more... somewhere more quiet <laughs> oh come on I don't bite <laughs> what got a problem oh am I holding you up you lost or something what got a problem oh am I holding you up shit Guess I'll wait here. <laughs> Look who's come waltzing What do I do to back. trigger them? You got it. Just straight ahead. What? Got a problem? You lost or something? <laughs> Nothing interesting over there. What you going that way for, man? It's about time. Oh. <laughs> you ain't getting away. Well, they, they follow you. Nothing interesting over there. Where do you think you're going? 
nothing interesting over there. What you going that way for, man? Uh-huh. Keep going. You got it. Just straight ahead. Oh. Super weird. And here we are. <laughs> Now we can have a nice private talk without anyone butting in. <laughs> <laughs> it's time you got a lesson in the way things work around here. Don't worry, you can thank us later. <laughs> yeah! You had your chance. <laughs> Let's do this. Allow me. This ends here. Now you're ready for it. <laughs> you know, you could have just told us you were out of our league. I mean, uh, thanks for the match. It was a real learning experience. Wasn't it, boys? <laughs> oh, right. We got something special for you. A gift to remember us by. Here. And with that, we'll hurry up and get out of your hair. Right, boys? Yeah. yeah. Very sorry to have troubled you, but we won't do it again! Promise! <laughs> can't actually attack here, though, so I can't even bring those boxes. Good lord. <laughs> Pico's as ready as he'll ever be. If you can't win, you got no one to blame but yourself. I think it's chuckle racing time. So, you ready or what? Yep. About time. Let's get this show on the road. Come with me. Actually, on second thought, I'll take him up top. That work for you? Say what? <laughs> Fine. You want to go roll in the hay with this idiot? Go wild. And on that note, follow me. It's hard to believe this. You better not embarrass us. Died Wally. in the desert. You should have seen him that first day, the poor boy. More dirt than Chocobo. Couldn't so much as give us a quail without coughing up sand. He's a whole new bird now, though. Might even have what it takes to win. Question is, do you? Even the fastest Chocobos can't win Jack without the right jockey. I've seen my fair share of promising birds wasted on riders who didn't know their asses from a hole in the ground. Believe me, in the racing world, it's all about who's holding the reins. No pressure, though. Okay, on you go. Ooh. 
Okay. Whoa, the physics on that rope. Competing in the race today? Yep. We'll get your bird prepped for you. Just sit tight in the jockey lounge. And no wandering off, okay? Hmm. <laughs> A bug boy? Huh? <laughs> hey there, Joe. Why, Esther, you grow lovelier by the day. Sure I do. Oh, where are my manners? This here's Joe. He's one of Sam's jockeys. <laughs> and as much as it pains me to admit it, the man's far and away the best rider in the sport. A pleasure to make your acquaintance. This is Cloud, an up-and-coming star of the track. And all ours. Be sure to wave hi when he laps you. Well, sounds like you got a fan, son. <laughs> I wonder though, you win her over with your skills or with one of them smoldering looks? <laughs> Don't see why it can't be both. About time I had some competition, assuming Esther's not full of it. For both our sakes, I hope she isn't. <sighs> Forget him. The race is starting soon, so stay focused. Speaking of, you might want to consider practicing. The sim here can help with that. Indeed. It's literally Mario Kart.
I wonder how you how skipping works in the actual race. If that's the thing you can really do. You do have to counter steer that a little harder, but all right. Yeah, each map definitely has to have shortcuts for the player for sure. But it's yeah, it's Mario Kart. I'm just brushing up on my bird calls before the race. All his pastries. I will beat Joe. I will be famous. I will beat Joe. Those are sandwiches, burgers, boigas. Your first race ever, and it's with Joe. Yeah. Aw, a bug boy. I'll go easy on ya. You better do right by me and Pico and not lose today, you hear? Especially not to one of Sam's birds. What if I do, dude? It's my first freaking time. You ready to make your debut in the racing world? Our next race will begin shortly. All participating jockeys, please proceed to the paddock. <laughs> you good to go? Ooh, whoops. Oh, whoops. Speed acceleration always make a juggler run faster. The more weight, you can fly short distances, but also be harder to knock around. Quartering helps turn better. Strength keeps them from slipping around. Intelligence affects the potency of their chocobo ability. We have three different parts in their body, the head, torso, and legs. Each part of the gear has done such attributes. You can augment your chocobo. Oh. Here it comes with a unique skill that activates automatically when you meet its conditions. You can set up to four sets of gear, three racing sets, and one world set. I just put this on to look different. Automatically increases all attributes of place seventh or lower heading to the final lap. Less than how much you slow down when damaged. The race with one dash available. Lessens how much you slow down when you leave the track. Interesting. OK. 
Okay. Kind of going like Mario stats, but I want more like strength cornering. I don't want like super acceleration. I want the other stats to be pulled up. I don't want to be going off road most likely. I can spend that much bumping and like bumper cars are in, bump, bumper chocoboing we're doing. survived that recent shooting. <sighs> You're not talking about the Colosseum, are you? Yes, I was there. Or I would have been had I not gone to the bathroom just before. That's amazing. <gasps> You're so lucky. Aren't I just? Which is why I know my bird's a winner. <laughs> Ooh, what a scrumptious looking parfait. And with plenty of butterscotch, I see. Bottoms up. Ooh. <laughs> <laughs> Got eyes on him. Oh, I'm fine, thanks. <laughs> Do you know how hot it is out here? I'm melting. God, what asshole decided our uniforms had to be black? I'll be there as soon as I can. <laughs> you freaking better. And bring something cold to drink. Or better yet, ice cream! Is vanilla No, okay? vanilla. Seriously? I'm getting heat stroke over here! I'm gonna die! You want that? Do ya? <sighs> Wish you were here, partner. <laughs> All right. I don't really see many skips yet. Oops. Maybe here? Dude, he is very fast.
Nice. Got Mario Kart hand on that. I haven't done that in a while. just provided the encouragement and thanks to you my prison's gonna be a goddamn palace good for you mm. Ooh, so frosty but here in the desert we like it hot fiery dangerous <laughs> yeah i'll bet now where's our guy <laughs> easy snowflake solemn gus is a man of his word are you scared i'll break my promise Oh. That tunnel over there will take you where you need to go. Past all that quicksand like a slippery little sidewinder. And at the other end, one of my beautiful vultures will be waiting to guide you through the desert. So be a good tourist. We got old Shooty McShooterson tied up nice and tight in a shack out in the scrapyard. But now he's all yours. Turn him over. Give him his just desserts. It's your call to make. Okay. So we're still not going out yet. You guys moving on then? And what are you going to do? Since you put Pico's name on the map, we'll stick around for a bit. Try and get a winning streak going. Besides... We still got a score to settle. Sure you'll be okay on your own? No man with a bird is ever truly alone. Hey, Cloud. I know you need to hit the road, but... If you're ever itching to get back in the saddle, come around. Pico will be here. No, we'd love a victory lap. I'm sure there's many more races to do as well. Now we just gotta square things away with Shinra. And with an articulate fellow like me leading the talks, that'll be a cinch. Don't suppose you're in the market for a charming young racing consultant. Don't suppose you're in the market for a... Thanks to you, we made a kill it out there! Woo! <laughs> Alright, into the dust bowl. There's no way Barrett shot those people, right? Are there any other gun armed dudes who might have gone on a killing spree? We know him. He'd never do that. Well, we'll find out soon enough. So Kate Sith is just like hanging out, right? He's not actually in the party. Yeah. So Red needs to finish his, uh, Fervor weapon. Oh, we're locked. It's just, it's the. Okay. Can't change party members. Fix all my materia. That's what I was gonna check as well. Oh, Yuffie's missing something. Or no, she just earned another materia slot.
heck? We don't have a truck above out here though, so we're just running. Move some of the fog of war. surge there for a moment it looked like I wonder if this will actually be Barrett or if it will be Dine instead or both. Downs. Let's do this. Shit. Get him. Sorry. See you around. Goodness.
Chewing on sand for weeks. <laughs> <laughs> Thank God we found you. We were worried. You on the lamp, big guy? The hell I am. <sighs> what are you guys doing all the way out here anyway? Looking for whoever decided to shoot up the Coliseum lobby. They said the culprit had a gun for an arm. They did, huh? Tell me it wasn't you. Frankly, it might as well have been. Barrett, talk to us. I know the man who murdered all those people. Dine, my best friend. It was four years ago. The Corral reactor had just gone up. Dine and I had been to check it out, see what the deal was. But on our way back... None of this makes any sense. That explosion could have brought down the whole mountain. So where the hell's Shinra? That's a damn good question. Whatever. We need to get back. Tell them what we found. God. No. Hmm. Shinra, they just showed up and started shooting. I think they're trying to cover up what happened at the reactor. To pin the blame on... Hey! Over here! Uh. Damn. Please. Don't. This ain't happening. God damn it. The village. Marlene and Eleanor might still be there. You ready? For what? <laughs> still so quick to throw in the towel, ain't you? Come on. Damn it. Oh, this 
Seriously, do I have to do everything? <sighs> Shinra has a reputation for safety to uphold. Which makes you liabilities. Oh, how very great. So Merlin's. I managed to get away, but I was bleeding out. Figured that was it. Until Doc Sheeran came along and saved me. Put me back together. Most of me anyway. There was no saving my arm, so I made a call. Instead of the normal prosthetic, I chose a means to an end. Guess Stein had the same idea. I guess he did. I resigned myself to the fact that he was dead, but if I'd known he'd survive too, I... So that's why Dain shot all those people? To get back at Shinra? I don't know. I saw him at the saucer, saw the bodies and the bullet holes. But that's not who Dine is. Whatever his faults, he's not a monster. If I can find him, talk to him, I know we can figure this out. Well, okay. What are we waiting for? Time like the present. Oh, weapon. Charging uppercut. Do it. I'm coming, hanging out. Follow my lead. Good night. No time to waste. For sure. I'm 
sorry, but I need to do this alone. Barrett. Go. Yeah, that makes sense. Dying. That's you. Hey. I know you. Dying. Hang on. I'll get you out of here. <laughs> As I live and breathe, Barrett Wallace. Come on. I'm bless your heart dropping by for Eleanor's birthday. What? Hell, Marlene, set a place for Barrett. <laughs> yeah, he's looking fit as a fiddle. Oh, good question. She ain't with him. Where's Myrna? She ought to be here. Dine. What happened to you? Though, come to think of it, I don't see a gift, neither. But you ain't the kind to come empty-handed. Hmm. God damn it. his kind doing here you son of a bitch still living on Shinra's kill no man it ain't uh, like that uh, <laughs> stop go on then do it Please, I'm here to help you. <laughs> you? Here to help me? <laughs> He's here for you. To take the load off your shoulders, right? Same old shit. Back. 
this is between us and no one else. Hmm. Hmm. Just you and me then. Right here. Right now. Can't probably should have put the Cess earring on him. That's right. Ain't no plan. Didn't really figure it'd be a whole boss fight. Oh, it does go under the ground. Okay. grief.
What the hell, man? Okay. How many times are we talking here? Scan later. Get on with it. No, Dan. It's over. Over? You think this is over? This ain't even close to over. Then end it. Kill me. I can't live like this anymore. Stay away! <laughs> You'd like that, wouldn't you? A way out. But where's that leave me, huh? <laughs> I thought you wanted to help your own buddy! Words. Coward. When the going gets tough, he's gone. Yeah, you're right. About everything. I should have never believed him. But that money. Change our lives. Well, it changed them all right. Hmm. You know, I can hear her now. Eleanor, as clear as day, begging me to stop, give you the benefit of the doubt, saying you ain't done nothing wrong. But then who's gonna answer for what happened? Oh, I know. Shinra! Always Shinra! Oh. <laughs> Turn four. She's in Midgar. Look at that. She's got her mommy's eyes. Hair, too. <laughs> After everything went down, I didn't know what to do. Myrna was dead. And I figured you were, too. All I had was guilt and regret, and the weight of it was too much. But Marlene gave me the strength to carry on. <laughs> she nearly died that day. House was about to come down when I heard her crying. And ever since, she's been my reason to get up in the morning. You took my baby girl from me. You knew she meant the world to me. You knew. 
And still, you took her. That's not true. You took everything from me. Everything and everyone. Dying, we can go see Marlene right now. Look at me, Barrett. You think I want Marlene to see what her father's become? Stop! With all this goddamn blood on my hands, how could I ever hold my daughter again? Man, half an hour ago, we were uh, chocobo racing. <laughs> oh, what a performance, though. And who voiced Dine? My goodness. Way to send it. Whew. That was good. I mean, it was terrible, but that was good. Wow. It started off kind of shaky, but then, man, that... That last bit. Ooh, man. All right, that'll be it for this chunk. I realize how long it was. That was a lot of stuff in Hello Red Space. Thank you for watching live if you haven't been hanging out. Of course, you can come by and watch live if you want. You can also watch all the chunks on YouTube. Got a whole bunch. There'll be a whole bunch more. Also got Remake and Bloodborne and all the Dark Souls and the two God of War games and the two Jedi games and Super Mario RPG and Final Fantasy 16. A whole bunch of other stuff up there. <laughs> If you want to watch those, but otherwise I will catch you in the next one. Whew. <clears throat>